Here in this video, I am going to show you that how you can integrate Paymill Payment Gateway into your website. So let me show you the demo first and then after I will show you step by step that how you can create the account and then after you can uh, uh, do the testing and uh, finally you end up with the actual payment into your website. So we have actually I have enabled, enabled SAPA, Visa, MasterCard, Mastro and American Express and uh, many more uh, others. Uh, which are not enabled yet but uh, we can enable those as well so uh, currently if I am interested to do the credit card payment I can click on here and if I am interested to SAPA I will click on here so let me do a SAPA payment for the test purpose so that I could uh, verify you that this is working so here I have a test IBN number and I'm going to right here uh, account holder name and then after I have to I write IBAN number and then we have BIC number which is actually called as Swift code all right then after I have to click on I have ag read and agreed uh, agree to the website conditions and then you have to click on place orders So finally the order has been received and uh, the payment from payment order ID is this one and payment method is payment mill, uh, pay mill and all the details are over here. All right. So this means our payment has been successful now. So let me uh, tell you in the dashboard we will be getting that payment over here. So actually this comes after some time. So we will be waiting for it. Uh, until that I will be uh, showing you that how you can create the account for that yeah finally we got the uh, payment uh, which I have uh, did just now so you can see this this is the date to which I have uh, done and if I will be clicking on the transaction ID then you will be getting this uh, these details like transaction ID and uh, status code description and this is status that uh, payment has been completed and here you will be getting the account holder name which I have given over there and we have BIC and IBN number alright so all the details are over here so this is currently test mode so we can do uh, refund as well from here so now I am going to tell you that how you can do so first of all you have to go to its official website wait a minute paymill.com and there you will be getting everything uh, related to your payment gateway so here if you have to do the registration first you will be clicking over to register and then you will be filling this specific form over here and then click on create new account so in this way you will be uh, creating your account but for now I am interested to login because I have already created the account so I will be clicking on login then after once I logged into my account of paymill then I will be getting this specific dashboard and I have manage so subscription plans we can also create over here uh, in the pay mill and we have invoices option as well then we have some development related things like uh, test and live mode uh, for now we have the test mode uh, and if we wanted to enable the uh, live mode then we have to send them uh, the email uh, to uh, pay, me, pay, mill, um, uh, pay mill customer service so they will be identifying our business and th then after they will be sending us uh, the live credentials of uh, live actually live keys all right so for testing purpose they are actually providing some test card data from our website once you will be clicking over here you will be getting this specific page and from here you can get the test card details which I have already used so these are the card details and we have the SAPA details as well direct debit SAPA so everything is over here you can go through and 
just use these details all right so in the wordpress how you can integrate yeah finally we will actually if you if you will go to question answer then you will be getting to know about that what are the possible ways to which you can able to integrate so if you will be clicking on inter integrations actually all the platforms they have written over here web api application mobile integration plugins and extensions so they are also providing the uh, plugins as well so let me click over here and this one as well yeah we have the php python java ruby dot net javascript so all these are available for uh, for us and if you will go for plugins they are actually uh, providing the plugin for woocommerce and uh, presta shop magento shopware but for now i am going to implement woocommerce so if you will be getting uh, if you will be on your dashboard of uh, wordpress website then you will be uh, getting the option uh, on clicking your plugins once you will be clicking your plug plugins uh, menu then you will be getting this specific page and if i am interested to install that plugin then i have to click on add new but make sure that already you have uh, installed woocommerce uh, plugin so here you will be uh, writing paymill all right so once you will be finding from here then after you will be getting this specific option pay mill for woocommerce i have already activated but if you are interested you can in, uh, in uh, activate it from here install and then activate and then after you will be uh, getting the option inside the woocommerce setting so i am going to click on settings here you have to click on payments then you will be getting all the options of uh, woocommerce uh, whatever uh, uh, plugins you will have installed already but you will be finding this one as well because you have installed the plugin and this is payment paymill uh, payment so here you have uh, to enable this one and then you can click on manage and you will be uh, getting this title this must be enabled from here all right then after you go to uh, in the left bottom corner you will be getting pay mill uh, option then you have to click over there and you will be getting these specific things pay mill payment api key and then you have pay mill public api key so these are actually needed and uh, you will be getting these two keys from your account so here when you will be clicking on development api keys then you will be getting your private test key and public test key from here all right so you have the option to generate new test keys as well but for now i have already uh, copy pasted from there to here so now what i need to do is i need to select any specific payment option from here like i am interested to accept sapa mastercard mastro uh, card uh, visa card and american express so once you done with this then you should uh, click on save changes all right so everything would be saved and then after you will be uh, going to your website for example i am here and if you will be clicking on buy now button you will be redirected to your checkout page once you will be adding to cart then this is your cart and all the details are over here of your purchase then you have to click on purchase proceed to checkout so here you will be, have to fill all the details billing details and you will be getting the option to uh do the payment so this time i am interested to do the credit card payment so let me copy paste mm, wait a minute
actually I have to get the test keys So here I have visa let me copy this from here and then I am going to paste it over here and account holder is body and I am going to write here the dummy future future date here sorry What is this? We have to enter four characters. Then after we have to enter uh, security code. So when uh, when all these are verified, then you have to click on I have read and agree to the website, and then click on place order. So finally, you will be getting this specific option like order received. So with whatever email you will have added here, you will be getting the message as well that you have purchased something. And finally, if you will be coming to your dashboard, you will be getting your transactions here. Yeah, this transaction we have did just now. So let me show you. So client ID created last date and the status is complete and this card type was a visa card card number expiry date and everything is over here so that means we got a successful test payment of uh, the pay mill payment gateway so if you are interested to activate this one so that you could get the uh, actual payments uh, so at that time you have to contact to your uh, to uh, support team let me show you actually they have already written here yes info it is not possible to change to the live mode as long as your account has not been activated we will contact you uh, per email with the next steps to complete the activation of your merchant uh, merchant account so actually they will be providing you few keys uh, if you are uh, not activated if you have not activated into live mode currently we are using in test mode so then after they will be uh, actually providing you the live API keys into your uh, genuine registered email address so this uh, if you are if you wanted to disable this test mode from here they have actually disabled this specific button already so now finally we end up with the uh, payment gateway integration of paymill I think if you have a good understanding you uh, can proceed further if you are still facing some problem you can contact me i will be adding my uh, contact details in the description so you can contact me anytime if you are facing any issue in any specific payment gateway i have worked a lot in uh, credit card debit card stripe payment gateways 3d secure sea uh, sepa direct debit uh, and uh, one more is like uh, wire card uh, so all these uh, ideal so all these payment gateways I have already integrated so if you are uh, facing any problem and you wanted such type of uh, integrations you can contact me and even I am also developing websites as well so feel free to ask the question in the comment section I will definitely try my best to reply you as soon as possible so subscribe this channel and uh, see you in the next video